Yesterday it was deal done, now for the hard work. The rollout of the entire national broadband network will take nine years, but for some it can't come soon enough. Consumers are paying a premium for high-speed internet, but it doesn't always make it through the front door. As Nicole Chettle reports, the nation is littered with buildings using ageing copper wires that will need replacing long before the NBN can get up to speed. Troy Townsend's an electrician, fed up with Apache internet service. I'd continually get dropouts or I'd come home and there'd be no net connection for, for days. The signal to the building was fine, but old copper wires were disrupting the flow to his second floor flat. The provider's claiming they're getting up to 21 meg speed and realistically they're, they're probably only seeing one or two meg. And the problem lied um, between the, the basement here where the telephones come in and my unit itself upstairs. A new cable fixed the problem, but Troy Townsend's not alone. He often gets calls for help from frustrated net users. All too many times, customers calling up with filter problems or the, their provider saying that, oh, no, no, it's a problem in your unit. The cabling itself is what lets the team down. Internet companies trade on the need for speed, but they're hitting hurdles when the cable from the street meets ageing buildings. Buildings around the country... Uh, that were built in the 1960s and 70s were simply not built with the sort of technology we have today in mind. Like leaky water pipes, damaged copper cables are a silent nuisance. Just about everywhere in Australia there is going to be a very big problem with copper very soon. The problem is the NBM will make copper redundant and no one wants to invest in old technology. But it could be a long wait. For some, the NBN's nine years away. People are crying out for better services. So we need clarity because consumers are so dependent on their broadband, they can't be waiting nine years. So for the one in five Australians living in strata communities, the body corporate has a tough decision. Upgrade now or play the waiting game. Nicole Chettle, ABC News.